The Cavs are down, but again, as we have said, oh, I don't know, several times, still got LeBron James. Mm -hmm. Leads all players in points and assists this series. Mark, does LeBron have a path to finals MVP? First, I would have to s just point out that the New York Times respectfully declined to participate in award voting, so I'm relieved oh. that I'm not part of this okay. voting body because I actually do think LeBron is still in the MVP mix. And even if they get swept, if I was voting, I would ponder it because the guy is carrying the most insane load we have ever seen. I think, I think my favorite, I mean, it, my favorite stat coming into this series, LeBron had scored or assisted on 55%. Oh, is, by the way, you're seeing what happened in the huddle yeah, his, after the his JR dribble out, and then they found out that a timeout left, and there's this, his body and facial expressions. You can see it. We had timeout. This, this is the video is crazy. I almost want to go off topic and talk more about this video. Because well, well, that, well, that's, I mean, that's the thing. He's exasperated. They look like a team that's ready to break. And, and that's my question. Are the Warriors, the, the, the Warriors have shown precious little ruthlessness in this playoff run. Right. But this is a team that is ready to break. Right. LeBron is at his wits end. These other guys, I think Tristan's rant summed up how demoralized they are after they should have won game one. They got hammered in game two. There. I, I mean, I, 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 think, I think the Warriors I think are definitely better, and I think Warriors that maybe LeBron will do something sharp. else this summer. But I think that if we've seen anything from the Cavs in the past two months, it's that they can look down and out, and then they will walk back out on the court. Uh, but they haven't but played play, this team. Yeah, they're, they're not playing the Pacers much. and the but Celtics. That's not a prediction of winning. No, I know, that's just I know, saying that I'm when you saying. talk about their mental state and their resilience. The, 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 I believe JR. JR, you know, it's funny, JR mentioned it in his availability the day before game two. It's actually me who he had that conversation with. He said, oh, I was talking to someone after the game, and I said, I'd rather this happen to me because right. I can handle it. I won't remember it out there. But, but he and still... And I, I can't vouch for everything JR said after mm -hmm. game one being true, but that part was true. But he, he did say that to he, me. He did say that, but and then I believe we, him. we saw what happened in game two. He was terrible. And the but he's been terrible in plenty of games true. where he didn't screw up the That's game true. before. So, That's true. <laughs> you know. I, I guess my thing yeah. is, as it pertains to the finals MVP, MVP to, yeah. to answer the question, you and my buddy Chris Haynes, you guys are crazy. If they get swept, he can't win finals MVP. I don't care if he averages 70 points a game. He can't win finals MVP if they get swept. They have to at least give us the illusion of competitiveness before I can start to say, Steph Curry, you're, look, you're in, amazing, in but I got to give this to somebody else. In practical terms, you're probably right. And Stephen Curry's never won finals MVP, and that was a big story. Steph made the big deal in his pre-finals yeah. press comments about, wow, it only took you guys two questions to get to this, right. and you're already asking me, can I win finals MVP? So you're probably right. He probably wouldn't if they're swept. But again, the load this guy is carrying is unprecedented. Yeah. Coming into this series, I respect it. LeBron was scoring or assisting on 55% yeah. of the Cavs points. Allen Iverson was only at 47% the year he, he willed. He that game the, one the, win in 2000. I, I mean, how, and how many people were talking about Allen Iverson should have been finals MVP that year? Not you. Come on. <laughs> how many other really? people? Is that part of what, I, what I chapter in final in awards reform is that? I love it. Uh, I, I'm in the tank for Allen Iverson. He could like trip over the stage and I'd be like, look, that's an MVP performance. I don't care. He's my favorite guy. Um, I, I will say I, I do think it's interesting, though, because this gets back to you talk about awards reform. I'm not going to get back on your soapbox about it. But, um, you know, this this comes back down to are we doing it to the guy that puts up the best stats or had the best performance or the best player? Because it's definitely going to be a warrior I would think that if you have those other well, three guys on the on the tape on the team with you you are going to be allowed to put together the best game or the best stats but still if you had all these guys on the playground it's it's a decision but I bet a lot of people would still pick LeBron first as their first overall pick. Well Rachel since you have that soapbox you throw it on the table look in that camera and tell Adam Silver we need a playoffs MVP. Yeah is this the playoffs MVP? Or the series MVP, MVP, and historically it is the it is the series MVP. MVP. I I was a voter for Iguodala the year he won a, a vote that still mm -hmm. infuriates people. But yes, if if there if this is playoffs MVP, LeBron James yes. is the playoffs Absolutely. MVP in a walk. Right. Well, but that's not. It, I don't think that's going to change for this year. What could change is whether voters decide is this the best performance in the finals, mm -hmm. in which case you have to weigh in the fact that your team won or not, yep. like that's part of it, versus is this the best player in the finals? Those are two different questions. Yep. Who's the most valuable player? I, and I, I don't have an answer yet. I've been a voter the last two years. I obviously, in 2016, I didn't know until the last basket went in who I was going to vote for last year. It felt much more clear to me that it was KD, but I don't have a sense of it yet, so I, I don't know.